Hey guys, what is going on? And today is NXOE Day. It's Phil Spencer's Xbox One version 2.0. Now it is a new chapter in the Xbox franchise. Um, I'm going to give you a few things what you'll notice today. Um, you do not have to update um, straight away you but you have until November the 23rd and when it will just manually do it itself so the update will be sitting in your um, settings for console um, settings so you will uh, be prompted to update the update is just over a gig in size so I'm gonna run you through a few things uh, what you'll notice when you download the update uh, what you'll first know is is the brand new Xbox One UI. Now you've probably seen it on YouTube videos, you've probably seen it, Major Nelson talking about it, but you will notice it is quite snappy and a lot faster than what you are used to. And also the biggest um, new feature for now, as we all know, is the Xbox One backwards compatibility, which allows you to play old Xbox 360 games on your shiny new console. But that doesn't come for another six or seven hours after the update. I think it's going to launch after 6 p.m. UK time. So if you've got games there, do not worry. After 6, 7 p.m. tonight, if you're in the UK, just keep refreshing your games library and any games you have owned um, will pop up there ready to install. Or if you've got discs, you can pop them in after that time. So it's around about 12 p.m. Uh, to 3 p.m. in the US. Um, your pins, uh, whereas previously all your pins would sit to the left hand side of UI, this uh, time they're all on your home screen and you can quickly access them. If you pull the right trigger from the home screen, you'll instantly jump to your pin content. Once to get back, just press the left trigger and it will jump back up to the top. Uh, you can have up to 28 pins rather than the 12 of the original UI. More content exactly where you want it. The new side panel. Uh, the magical new side panel where you will be your best friend in the new Xbox One experience. It pulls together all those fiddly context sensitive menus of old into one useful menu. Access by adding to the left of the home screen. The side panel gives you quick access to your friends list, notifications, messages and importantly the settings. So uh, it is a, an easy way. Um, I like it. I've been using it now for about five weeks. Uh, it also contains a snap menu offering all up all the apps you can run side by side. And right at the top, there's your profile with a quick link to all your achievements. Uh, the side panel is accessible from anywhere in the new Xbox One UI. Simply double tap the Xbox logo on your controller and it'll pop up. What's more, if you do this from a game, you'll get prompts for capturing screenshots and game footage. As you know, hit Y to screenshot or X to record that. The community, now we all know the, the community is a big part of the Xbox One experience. Um, when you're in the new homepage, hit the right bumper and you'll be transported to uh, the new community hub. From here you'll see everything from your friends, what they've been up to on Xbox. You can follow games, share your own thoughts, screenshots or footage and gen generally uh, have a good old night with your mates. Uh, the One Guide, where the Xbox One Guide TV experience was a separate app in the previous UI. The TV service is now truly part of the home screen. Hit RB twice. Um, from the home screen and you'll be taken to the one guide which is so much more than just live TV nowadays all your streaming services are there along with options to watch TV shows and movies from your own libraries you'll even be presented uh, with recommended content available through other services such as YouTube Blinkbox and all that uh, the store the store has had a major overhaul um, and is accessible by pressing the right bumper three times from the home screen what looks to be a single tab actually fans out uh, into four distant sections. Uh, games, apps, movies and TV and music. Movies and TV and music are pretty self-explanatory in terms of what content is on offer. But it's the apps tab that really, um, that's really one to watch. Although apps is a little sparse right now. Uh, we don't know which ones uh, those will be just yet. But you know that your Xbox One is about to be get more useful. So yeah, so have a play about of it. Let, let us know if you get any update, if you've got it, whatever. And uh, I look forward to uh, reading your comments. And as I always say, thanks for watching. Keep it gaming. And peace out. Y'all gonna learn today. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We them boys. Dream team. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We them boys. Right, you bitch. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We making noise. Ain't nothing safe.